Hi everyone, happy Saturday. Um, I had a little bit of time today and wanted to do a quick video to check in with you guys since we haven't had a video posted since this past Monday. Um, it's been a very, very busy week this week. Um, towards the beginning of the week, I groomed the boys Monday through Wednesday, I think it was. I think I finished up Wednesday or was it Thursday? I can't even remember because I only do a couple dogs a day. So I'm not overwhelmed. Um, and if you saw the video we posted Monday was of me grooming Milo. And a lot of people noticed in that video that Milo hates his front paws clipped. Yes, he does. All the boys hate their front paws clipped, but Milo and Miggy give me the most problems when I'm trying to clip their paws. Max, what are you doing? <laughs> now your beard's all staticky, Max. I don't know if you can see him. I can't see that far. Um, Yes, yeah, so the beginning of the week was very busy with grooming dogs, and then the end of the week has been my aunt's um, funeral services. Um, I just got back, as you can tell, I'm all in my black outfit here. Um, just got home from the visitation um, today, and then I, we've got to go back at 5 o'clock for the uh, funeral service. So, yes, it's been a very busy week. And I just wanted to get on and check in because a lot of people have sent me messages wondering if everything's okay. The boys are all fine. They're all freshly groomed. They're all doing good. I did have to take Max to get his anal glands expressed. Um, he was having some problems scooting around the floor on his butt. <laughs> and um, he's never had that. None of my boys really have, they don't have problems usually with their anal glands, but he was having some problems. So um, my husband took him into the vet for me because I was busy um, grooming and stuff, and um, he had to get his anal glands expressed, which isn't a, b a big deal, um, and he's been fine ever since. Um, Miggy got his, where is Miggy? Miggy's over here. When they're groomed down, and I just look at them from um, their backside, like on their back and the back of the head, I get Mozzie and Miggy confused sometimes when they're all groomed up. They look like the same dog from behind. <laughs> Miggy got his heartworm screening and he got a couple vaccinations. Uh, that all went good. I had him look at his teeth. Um, they said just a light bit of tartar on a couple teeth that his teeth look great. Um, if you've been watching a while, Miggy, when he was, I think when he was four, I believe he's going to be six this year. Um, he um, had 17 teeth pulled at once. Is he going to be six or seven? Oh my goodness, I can't remember offhand. Max's birthday is coming up March 18th. He's going to be eight years old. Um, I think he's going to be six. <laughs> I better write all I need to start writing them on the calendar. I thought it was Marley's birthday coming up, but his is in April. It was actually, it, Max is in March. So yeah, I need to put it on my calendar so I'm not getting confused. Um, so yeah, everything went great with Miggy. His teeth are looking great. Um, I wanted to say thank you to a couple people who sent me some mail. I wanted to say thank you to Emily who sent me, a, let me come up here, sent me a Valentine's Day card and a gift for the boys. Thank you so much, Emily. And then Judith sent a Valentine's Day card and a gift for the boys. I thank you so much. And then I got a letter from Paula. Um, and a little comic, she sent a little comic here, if you want to pause it. Let me make sure there was no information on the side. No. Um, you could probably pause it and read it there. <laughs> Quite funny. <laughs> so thank you guys so much for the mail and the gifts. I thank you so much. Um, wasn't expecting that at all and I really appreciate it. And um, I'm glad you guys are all still enjoying the videos, even though they've been kind of sparse lately. Um, so, yeah, that's what's been going on around here. Not too much. I've already started buying the boys gifts for their Easter eggs kits. Yes, I have. I know Easter is like, what, two months away? <laughs> I've already bought some toys and some treats. I'll have to, um, when I have more time, get them out and share them with you guys, what I've gotten so far. Um, I'm always thinking head like that. When you start seeing things, um, you got to get them now before they're all gone, you know? So I, whenever they start putting out the stuff early, I know a lot of people do not like when they put Christmas out before Thanksgiving. 
or they put Easter out before winter's over, but I really appreciate it because then I get what I want before everybody rushes in at last minute and buys it. So I like to um, have choices <laughs> to choose from. So yeah, so everybody's doing really good. Um, a lot of people wanted to know from our video on uh, Monday of me growing Milo, um, they had some questions about the equipment I use and uh, especially the table. It's made by, I think the brand is called Go Pet Club. Um, I got it on Amazon. Um, but if you want to see all the grooming supplies I use, our Amazon store is linked in the description box down below this video. So if you want to click on that link, it'll show you um, all the grooming products. As long as they're still available on Amazon, they'll be in our Amazon store. Um, I also, uh, I know a lot of people say they can't get to the comments in the description box. I don't know if it's because um, you're on a tablet maybe trying watching the videos. I'm not sure. If you're not subscribed to the channel, I know it won't show you. I'm pretty sure it won't show you the description box or the comments. So I'm not sure exactly why you're not seeing it. So make sure you're subscribed uh, to the channel if you're not. But um, if you can't get to the description box below this video, if you go to our uh, Schnauzer Mom Facebook page, um, the first comment on that page has a link to our Amazon store. So you can also go there and click on that link there. And again, if you are going to purchase anything, purchase anything on Amazon, if you go through that link, it gives us a small percentage. It doesn't cost you anything extra. It gives us a small percentage of the sale, which I use and put into our medical fund or emergency fund for the boys. So we would really appreciate it if, if you're shopping on Amazon, if you'd shop through that link uh, so we get a little bit of money towards their medical fund. So um, yeah, so anything you want to find um, that I use grooming is in that Amazon store. So, and a lot of people wondered why I was shaving them down short because they keep their dogs long for the winter. Well, if you know when your schnauzer's hair is long in the winter and if you have a wet snow, the snow balls up into their hair. <laughs> they look like little snowmen. Um, and if their hair's long like that, you've got to get all that to melt and then um, it takes forever for their hair to dry, then they're cold longer. So if their hair is shorter, especially having six dogs, it's a lot faster for me to get them dry so they can keep warm. Um, I do put their um, sweaters on them and coats on them if it's really cold out. But um, if you got that long leg hair and belly hair going on um, on your dog's coat, it's just going to cling right to them and then they're cold longer. So that's why I still shave the boys down in the winter along with the summer as well. So it just helps keep them cleaner and more comfortable um, so they can get dry and be warm faster. So. That's why I shave them down in the winter too. I never had a problem with it before. So, all right guys, I'm gonna let you go. I'm gonna try to get this uploaded um, before we head off to the funeral services so I can get a video up to you guys. I, I felt so bad all week, but I just haven't had the time to sit down and videotape anything or think of ideas of what I wanna videotape. So, Hopefully after this busyness of grooming and funeral services, we can get back to a normal schedule. I don't know. I always say that and then I never know. Thinking about cutting my videos down to two a week instead of three a week or um, just put them up as I can. And um, I don't know. We will see. We will see how it goes. All right, guys. I hope everyone's having a great weekend and we will see you again soon. Bye.